Hi guys, I want us to have a demonstration of upcoming uh, system that I use Microsoft Access. That one will be payroll management system using uh, databases. So guys, uh, we start by loading the system. This is the splash form. Then the system goes to the payroll management system dashboard. Uh, so here we are using Microsoft Access and Visual Basic for application, uh, popularly known as VBA. So we have the data entry operations. We also have the reports uh, stroke um, summaries. So here, summaries are actually the reports. So uh, we can start by capturing the attendance uh, of the employees, where we have the attendance ID employee id date of attendance uh hours what overtime and uh, reef kind of reefs we have paid and paid sick reef and compassionate so that is the attendance module again we shall have the departments module we must capture the departments we have department id department name and the manager of the department like for example you can see we have different as uh, that is different departments then we shall have the employees uh, module this is whereby we shall capture the employees details as you can see these are the details that uh, we can capture uh, job title department hired date uh, account number etc you can see this is the employees capture modules then we have the payrolls Payrolls, this one is actually the uh, account, uh, the references, the payment references that somebody may type and see uh, who was paid when or which transaction took place when. Again, we have our last module here, the salaries module. Here, uh, we have the salary ID, employee ID, a tax deduction, overtime amount, bonuses, uh, other deductions, and net pay at the end of the the, the, the deductions so if i uh, go from here you can see now we have the uh, the tables these are the tables we have so we have the attendance table department employees payrolls payroll pays whatever then we have four queries deductions gross salary we have the net pay Payroll salary, then we have the forms, attendance forms, whereby we shall have uh, add, add our splash form and our main form or our dashboard or popularly known as um, a switchboard. So, after having done that, it is also important to look at the relationships. We shall have to go to database tools, then relationships. So, you can see the kind of relationships that uh, we have. So, this makes your database uh, to have rest tables and to be more accurate. Whereby you, you get that different uh, fields are related to different other tables in other fields. That is, you usually have the primary key in, like for example, here we have the primary key. Here we shall have the attend, uh, the, the, sorry, here we have the primary key from the employees, employee ID, and then we shall have the foreign key employee id going to other tables like attendance uh, table going to fields like payroll so the point of reference of this employee is the employee id when we go to something like department name here it's the primary key this now relates to department in the employee so we must have the primary key uh, in the mother table and foreign key in the child table so guys that is exactly what we shall be doing in our next session so make sure you subscribe if you haven't like and share these videos